Hi guys, how's it all going? Right, today I'm going to do a taste test of my mate's brew. It's got Mosaic and Simcoe in it. Not a lot of hops. Uh, I think it's 10 grams of Mosaic and 10 grams of Simcoe. Um, and he never dry hopped it. But I did the pretty much the exact same brew but there's 200 grams of hops in here 100 grams of mosaic and 100 grams of Simcoe uh, I just bottled this yesterday it's crystal clear and it smelled absolutely beautiful this has been conditioned here for two weeks now and he's been plowing through it so he brought one round and I gave him one of mine I'm gonna do a sort of like taste swap thingy. Right, let's crack open because I helped. I helped him brew this about a month ago. He went round his house. Uh, he's he's he used to do home brewing quite some time ago, but he just wanted to get back into it, and he's just been doing kit. So I, I've tried to, you know, make him progress into using um, steeping grains and trying to get away from the kits. Right. Oh, lovely little hairs. Bit of smoke. Hmm. Little bit of hop aroma. Right. Let's see what we got. Well then, there you go. It's not 100% clear. He said it's a bit murky, but it could be because it's been in the fridge. But it's got a great head. <laughs> yep. Nice aromas there. <laughs> Only slight though. Not surprising because one this one dry hopped. I did give him the option, but he wasn't too keen on that idea. Maybe next time. I I think he didn't want a a really hoppy beer. He just wanted to play it safe. But I really like my hoppy beer, so I'm like, well, I'm just putting all, all of my hops in there. But yeah. Right, sort of clearing up a bit, and I reckon in maybe a couple of weeks' time, if he's still got any of these left, it would age and probably become a little bit clearer. But, right, Right, that's quite nice. It's a bit bitter on the tongue, uh, a bit too bitter for my liking, but it's not too bad. It's sort of medium bodied. It's not definitely not thin. It's cracking head on it, and lovely and creamy. Yeah, now on the back palette, you're getting those mosaic hops and Simcoe. Well, I presume it's mosaic because I've never had them before. This is the first time. That's why I ploughed loads of my beer because I just want to know what the fuck it tastes like because everybody keeps going on about mosaic. <coughs> Carbonated, carbonation attack. Yeah. So um, I've had Simcoe before as well, so I know what that's like. Yeah, not a bad beer actually, considering it was his first attempt. Yeah, I quite like that. As I said, it's just a little bit 
bitter for my liking, but it's still a nice beer. So yeah, I would. So I, I would imagine the amount of hops that I use masks the bitterness in a lot of my brews. But I reckon, I reckon, Ian, mate, you could definitely up the ante on the hops, put some more in, even dry hop, 10 grams here, 10 grams there. Yeah, definitely. This, this is not that hoppy. You can taste the hops in it, but... Yeah, I like that. Well done, mate. Cracking brew. I can't wait for mine now. I'm going to wait three weeks at least. And I'm going to leave. I'm just going to leave them down, down there somewhere. Just keep them out of sight. And hopefully they'll be alright. Yeah, this is nice. Trying to get grips to this mosaic. Hmm. That's a nice hop. Yum, yum, yum. I can't wait for mine now. Anyway, I'm taking up way too much of your time. But yeah, cheers. Well done, Ian. Great beer. <coughs> it's carbonated. He was actually saying that it wasn't that carbonated. I beg to differ. It's lovely. Right then, see you later guys. Take it easy.